Welcome to Home Savvy, the show where we share insightful tips and creative ideas for your indoor and outdoor living spaces. Today we're going to show you how to enhance your home with interior paints. We're here at the Brownstone of the Pratt family where we're going to show you how to properly and successfully transform your walls with color. Let's go inside. We're here in the beautiful Brooklyn Brownstone of the Pratt family. We've got Simone, we've got Timothy and Christian who just fell asleep. And another son who's not with us, right? He's coming back from school soon? Right. He's in school, Jackson. Jackson. Before. Excellent, mm -hmm. excellent. So you guys have a gorgeous home. Thank How long? you. You've done a lot of work, I see. We did a lot of work. Every bit of wood that you see here was painted over with five coats of paint. It looks fantastic. Thank you. It really does. I know that you were talking about possibly painting this red vestibule like a more calming, soothing color. We'd like something lighter, something yeah. more inviting when people come in. That makes sense. Well, I think we can help you out today. <laughs> nice. We happen to have a Home Depot expert on hand. Come on, Yvette. Hello, everybody. So Yvette is the Pratt family, and they would like to kind of take down the color a little bit, do something a little more neutral, yeah. and we're hoping to come to you to find out the best tips to do that. Sure. Well, Today we're going to give you some tips on how to do it and let you know how easy it is to prep and have your hallway painted. When we did the renovations, he did a lot of this stuff himself, but I haven't painted before and it seems so daunting. It's like, oh, no, it's not. It's, no, it's, it's very easy and, and you yourself could try painting this. <laughs> I can, even, even I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> we're all going to do it. It's okay. going to look great. Cool. Okay. One of the few things that you do first off is to prepare the space for painting, which would include getting drop cloth, tape, a sponge to wipe the walls down, paint selection, brushes, and rollers. First thing you'll do is tape off all the corners with blue painter's tape and drop cloths. You have some selections there that you can choose from. You make sure that you don't have any cracks or holes in the wall. Typically when you take paintings off the wall, mm -hmm. you tend to right. leave a few pinholes. And so what we do <laughs> <laughs> what exactly. we do with that is get some light spackling and we put that on the wall. The rest of the wall is clean. You wipe it off with a, a wet rag or a damp mm -hmm. sponge, make sure it's dry. And then you apply the paint. Now with a red color like this, obviously you need a primer. Right. We so happen to have the best paint in the industry at the Home Depot, where we have paint and primer in one can. And so the application Awesome. That process is a lot easier. Yeah, because red, to tone it down, you need a little bit of primer. Absolutely. And that, so, would, that would save time going over the walls. Oh, absolutely. Uh -huh. So I'm back here with Timothy Pratt. We've just finished the paint job in the vestibule. We've taken it from a bright red to a white, more neutral color to open up the space. And um, I think it looks pretty good. What do you think? Yeah, we, we really like it. More than anything, it just really brightens up the space. It was. The red was a nice color, but yes. it was just very dark. And with dark woodwork, it kind of keeps it really damp. Right. So this really brightens it up. Like it's just kind of airy and, and really bright. So we're, we're more than happy. Oh, we're very happy that you're happy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and it seemed like an intimidating job, but I find that if you're using the premium products and you take the proper time for preparation and the right techniques, you can really get professional results every time. And we'd like to thank Yvette, our Home Depot associate, for walking us through this project. And of course, to the Pratt family, we want to thank the whole family. Thank Thanks, you. guys. And now we'd like to hear from you. Our question of the week is, what are your biggest painting challenges? Let us know in the comments section below. I hope this episode of Home Savvy was helpful. Log on to madamenoir.com backslash home savvy for more videos like this and for links to resources used in today's episode. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com backslash home savvy show or follow us on Twitter at home savvy show.